Let, help them call on the name of the Lord. Help them call on the name of the Lord. Just come to them right now and lead them to Jesus. Come on, lead them to Jesus. Hallelujah. If you believe Jesus was crucified for your sins and God raised him from the dead, all you got to do is ask him now. Somebody shout, it's for the asking. Hallelujah. You already believe or you wouldn't, you wouldn't even be at the altar. If you didn't believe, you wouldn't even be at the altar. Holy Ghost, I thank you. By the disobedience of one man, many were made unrighteous. That's the first Adam. But by the obedience of that last Adam, of that one man, Jesus, many were made righteous. Hallelujah. I give you praise, Jesus. God's going to give you many. Hallelujah. You will be. He's going to give you many. Heal to the kingdom. Holy Ghost, I thank you. I thank you right now in Jesus' name. God, every shackle, every chain is broke off. In the mighty name, give him many, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Whom I forgive, saith the Lord, is forgiven. Your sins I remember no more. They're remitted this day in my presence. You're mine. You're mine. You're mine. I accept you. Many have rejected you over your life, says the Lord. But I this day accept you. I embrace you. And I call you my daughter. My beloved, says the Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody lift your hands and bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. I thank you, Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. God says my hand's been on you since the womb. But this day, saith the Lord, I come and I open your heart and I do a work in you. I do a mighty thing in you this day. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Father God. Praise you, Jesus. Worthy. Holy. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Come, Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Here he comes. There's freedom. Whom the Son sets free is free in me. John 8, 36. Woo! Hallelujah. But whether I call you to liberty, Galatians 5, 13. Liberty in the name of Jesus. Every chain. He brought them forth out of darkness and you bring their chains asunder. Psalm 107, 14. Thank you, Father God. 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 Holy, 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 holy. Praise God. This altar's still open. I'm just going to follow the Holy Ghost. I'm just going to follow the Holy Ghost. He's my only assignment. There's a young lady in here. God is dealing with you right now. You feel like you're about to burst inside. Come to the altar. Come, just come. That's all you've got to do. He'll do the rest. You just come here. You just come to this altar. He'll do the rest. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Brother, play that song. It's a fun song, but it's a faith song. I'm not through. You need to come. You need to come. Start it over and turn it up before you start. Yeah. I'll be turned up a whole lot. I'd rather be too loud to start with. Tired of us around, you know I know what we'll do. And you're 
John 17, 3. Somebody said that's eternal life. That's eternal. Not knowing about him, knowing him. Yeah. That word know means being intimate with him. Intimacy in the MC. Praise God. Yeah. Knowing him. That's what Jesus done. So you might know him. That you might be intimate with him. That's the whole purpose of him shedding his bone the cross. Greater love hath no man than this, the man laid down his life for a church member. No greater love hath any man than this, the man laid down his life for his friends. John 15, 13. That word friend is the logos in Greek. It means someone to talk to. Jesus died for your fellowship, your friendship. Closeness. John chapter 15, verses 16. He said, You've not chose me, I chose you. And he said, I no longer call you servants, because a servant don't know what his master's doing, but I call you friends. Jesus shed his blood on the cross so you could spend time with him and know him intimately. Somebody said he talks. He really talks. John 10, 27, he said, my sheep hear my voice. I know yes. them and they follow me. Notice I know them. I'm acquainted closely with them. Amen. He shed his blood for relationship. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. I'm not going to take long to do this. And that's something usually I don't even say. But yeah, write that down. That's, that's worthy of penmanship right there, my friend. Amen. Print that out. Send it to my wife. She'll thank you. Praise God. Amen. He's talking about, you weren't ashamed to kiss your wife in public. Tell some others they ought to. I shouted out his mom was here, so I'd leave one over. <laughs> Amen. 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 God, how many days? It's, it's been a week and a half. Hallelujah. Amen. And Jesus, when he comes back to the earth, he ain't coming back for a girlfriend. He's coming back for a bride. Right. He ain't coming back for a Sunday morning date. All right. Yeah. He's coming back for a bride. Because in Acts 20 28, he shed his blood. Amen. He purchased the church of God with his own blood. A bride. That's why Revelation 21 and verse 7 says, Let the bride prepare herself, get herself ready. Why? Because a bridegroom is coming. Somebody shall be going on an everlasting honeymoon. It won't be long. Yeah. 